Hey, what's up, B? Welcome back to The Hive. My name is LSA, and it is my pleasure to guide you in today's flow. This week, I've been working on changing my perspective whenever negative things arise in my life. A lot of the times our brain, or pretty much our brain, is wired to see the negative in everything. It's just how we evolved, how we saw dangers coming, and it worked for our ancestors. But for now, since we pretty much are set and have everything we need, we have to overcome that negativity aspect in our brain. One quote that has resonated with me is from Wayne Dyer. And he says, if you change the way you look at things, the things you look at change. So bring that idea of turning your negative thoughts into positive ones. And let's recreate our brain structure. We'll get started with a short meditation to get us grounded and in the moment. So find a comfortable seat with your back upright option to close your eyes or have a soft gaze. Our meditation starts with the sound of the bell. Follow the sound waves until it disappears. Start by taking a deep breath, inhale, hold, exhale, sigh it out. One more, just like that, inhale, hold, exhale, melt into your mat. Begin to notice how you're seated, how your body feels today. Maybe there's a sense of heaviness, a sense of lightness. Just notice how you feel. We'll begin with the body scan. Starting from our toes. Slowly traveling up to your knees. To your hips. Taking a moment to pause at our solar plexus region. The wheel of energy that's in your abdomen area. Travel up to the heart. into your shoulders, to your throat, to your nose, Feel the exhale travel through your nostril. And 
and finally to the top of your head. Feel a sense of growing tall. Light radiating from your hair. And come back to your tactile sensations. Your mind begins to wander. Gently bring it back by counting your breaths to 10. Once you get to 10, start from the beginning. You will hear the bell indicating the end of our meditation. Follow the sound waves in. Just slowly open your eyes. Let me shrug your shoulders. Take a deep breath in through your nose. Exhale, side out. Come to neutral tabletop. Stack your shoulders on your wrist, your hips on your knees. Just sway side to side here. Start to wake up your hips. You want to lengthen your right leg. Lengthen your left. Get any kinks out. Today we are going to do a twist class. And our peak posture is Parivrita Bakasana. That is Twisted Crow. Inhale your right hand to the sky. Exhale, to thread it through your left. Drop down to your shoulders. Stretch out your left hand. Option to close your eyes and start to engage your ujjayi breath. This is the breath of the yogi. Inhale through your nose. 
Constrict the back of your throat. Exhale through your nose. Plant your left palm. Reach your right arm to the sky. Exhale, drop it down. Switch it out to the left. Inhale your left palm to the sky. Exhale, thread it through your right. Drop down to your shoulder, side of your head, and reach forward with your left hand. Again, come to your Ujjayi breath. One more breath, inhale. Exhale, plant your right palm. Reach your left arm to the sky. And exhale, plant your palms down. Start to warm up our spine. Inhale, cow, drop your belly, gaze forward. Open through your chest. Exhale, cat, round and curl. Push your mat away from you. Gaze between your knees. Inhale, cow. Open up through your chest. Gaze forward. Exhale, cat, round and curl. Push the earth away from you. One more inhale, cow. Exhale, cat. Inhale, tuck your toes. Exhale, downward facing dog. Adho Mukha Svanasana. Put all your feet left and right. And let's start with this simple twist here. With your right arm, reach back and grab your left leg. And send your gaze under your left armpit crease. Hold for one more breath, inhale. Exhale, plant your palms. Inhale, reach your left palm, grab your right shin. Gaze under your right armpit. One more breath, inhale. Exhale, plant your palms. Downward facing dog. Spread your fingertips out wide, soft part of your elbows or your crease. Your elbow crease is facing forward. Slowly melt your heels towards your space. Micro bend your knees if you need. Here for one more breath, inhale. Exhale, gaze forward. Travel to the top of your mat. At the top, ragdoll pose. Grab for opposite elbows, let your head hang heavy. Bend your knees as much as you need. Sway side to side in the wind. Slowly release your palms and inhale, slowly rise up one vertebra at a time. Big toes to touch, little sliver between your heels. At the top, shrug your shoulders up and relax them down your back. Close your eyes, bring your hands to heart center. Samastahiti. If you have an intention for your practice today, bring it to the forefront of your third eye. If your mind is drawing a blank, I offer the intention of positivity. Slowly rewiring your brain to see the joy in each moment. To fight against that negativity that arises and turn it into something beautiful. If this resonates with you, take a deep inhale. We'll seal it with an OM inhale. Oh. 
beautiful. Release your arms by your side. We'll start with a couple sun A's to get us warmed up. Inhale, Ardva Hastasana. Reach your hands up to the sky. Relax your shoulders down your back. Knit your ribs. Root down through your feet. Engage your quads and your glutes. Inhale, lengthen to the sky. Exhale, Uttanasana. Bow down. Micro bend your knees. Let your head hang heavy. Option to grab behind your ankles. We're just starting to warm up now, so nothing too crazy. <laughs> Inhale, halfway lift. Plant your palms, iron out your spine. Gaze over your mat. Feel the crown of your head grow towards the front. Inhale. Exhale, plant your palms, step back, high plank. Inhale, shift forward, halfway, chaturanga, lift the tops of your feet, inhale, upward facing dog, urdhva mukha, exhale, adho mukha, downward facing dog. Two breaths here, inhale, come up high on your toes, exhale, melt your heels to your space, one more, inhale, exhale, travel to the top of your mat. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, sweep your arms up. Exhale, Uttanasana. Inhale, out of the Uttanasana. Exhale, plant your palms, plank. Chaturanga. Flip the tops of your feet. Shine your chest forward, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. We're going to begin to pick it up. Here we go. Inhale, come up on your feet, your toes. Exhale, melt your heels. Inhale, gaze forward. Exhale, travel to the top of your mat. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, Urdhva Hastasana. Exhale, Uttanasana. Inhale, out of the Uttanasana. Exhale, plant your palms, jump back, chaturanga, flip the tops of your feet. Only your palms and the tops of your feet are touching. Chest is pushed forward, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, come up high on your toes. Let's move mindfully with intention. Inhale, gaze forward. Exhale, travel to the top of your mat. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale. Fold. Inhale, Ardva Hastasana. Exhale, Uttanasana. Inhale, out of the Uttanasana. Exhale, plant your palms. Jump back. Chaturanga. Flip the tops of your feet. Inhale, Ardva Mukha. Exhale, Adho Mukha. Last one. Again, bring your intention through your movement. As you're moving to Chaturanga, make sure your triceps are close to your chest and you're not dropping your belly. Inhale, gaze forward. Exhale, travel to the top of your mat. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, Ardhva Hastasana. Exhale, Uttanasana. Inhale, out of the Uttanasana. Exhale, plant your palms. Jump back, Chaturanga. Elbows close, flip the tops of your feet. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Okay, we're gonna begin our flow. It's gonna be a semicircle, so we're gonna travel around our mat. Get ready to twist. Inhale, gaze forward. Exhale, come to the top of your mat. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, Utkatasana. Chair pose. Glue your thighs together. Ah, and bring, bring weight to your heels. I'm already falling. See if you can wiggle your ten toes. Biceps next to your ears. Nice straight spine. Engage your core. 
Inhale. We're here for a couple more breaths. Find your base. Really focus on your structure. Inner thighs are glued, squeezing towards each other. One more breath, inhale. Exhale. Body vrita. Udita para gustasna. So your knees in line with your hip. Toes flex towards your right shin. Ground down through your left leg. Once you have this space, you can place both hands on your waist. Make sure your hips are going forward. You're going to send your left hand forward, right arm back for a nice simple twist. Engage from your core. Your chest is growing and then twisting. One more breath. Inhale. Exhale. Viparita Virabhadrasana. Drop your right foot back, 90 degree bend into your front knee. Left hand goes on your right thigh. Reach your right arm up, right arm up to the sky. Keep lunging into your front knee. Come up high on your back toes. Reach your right fingertips high. Engage your core. Scissor your inner thighs together. Find one more breath. Inhale. Exhale. Cartwheel your right arm down. Plant it next to your left foot. Open up your left arm to the sky. For Parivita Ashvasan Chalanasana. Twisted high lunge. Gaze up at your right fingertips. Come up high on your back toes. Point both hips forward. Bring a 90 degree bend ankle to knee alignment in your left leg high on your back toes flex your knee inhale one more breath exhale drop down your right knee bring your hands to prayer take a moment to just shift back and forth Parivita Anjanayasana and then the next breath, shift forward and twist, bringing your right elbow to the outside of your left knee. Glue the top of your right foot into the mat as you actively lunge into your left leg and bring that twist, prayer twist, to the left side. One breath, inhale. Exhale, big transition. Come up onto your right foot. Swivel your right foot down. Trikonasana. Bump your right hips to the side. Tick tock your arms north and south. Left leg is straight. Option to push against your left shin with your wrist or your palm. Gaze up. We tend to collapse forward in trikonasana, so really engage your obliques for external rotation. Inhale. Exhale. Sweep your right arm into a huge circle to where you graze your mat and point both big toes forward. Parivrita Padottanasana. Or Prasarita Padottanasana. Sorry. Your left palm reaches towards your right foot and twist your right arm or your chest so your right arm flies to the sky. Start to shift your weight forward onto your toes. Twist at your obliques. One breath, inhale. And exhale. Right foot, toes point forward. Shorten the stance on your left toe. Tick tock your arms north and south. Open up to trikonasana to the back of your mat. Gaze up at the sky, at your 
thumb. Again, bring awareness to your obliques. Engage them so that your hips aren't falling forward. One breath, inhale. And exhale. We will release here with Anjaneyasana. Bring your hands to heart center, drop down onto your left knee. 90 degree bend into your front leg. Shift your weight back and forth. Get a nice little hip opening. And inhale. Shift forward, exhale. Bring your left elbow to the outside of your right knee. Twist at your torso. Bring your hands to heart center. At the same time, continue to lunge forward into your right, right leg. And the back leg is glued to your mat, pushing against it, creating opening and space there. One more breath, inhale. And exhale, plant your right palm, rather your left palm, come up high on your left toes. Reach your right arm to the sky. Chalanasana. Again, keep lunging forward into your front knee, high on your back toes. Your twist comes from your chest and your torso. One more breath, inhale. And exhale, Viparita Virabhadrasana. Right arm goes on your left thigh, left hand reaches up to the sky. Both hips are pointing forward. Engage your core. Come back to that front lunge. Find a point of focus. Open up through your hips and your chest. Inhale. And exhale. Utita. Prasarita Pado Costasana. I think that's right. This time, left arm goes back, right arm goes forward. Twist. Inhale. Find two more breaths. Exhale, drop your hand, drop both feet. Reach your arms up to the sky, flow through a vinyasa. Shift your way forward. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Whew. So we'll do that on the way back, three breaths, and then we'll flow it, breath to movement. Getting our nice twist in, detoxing anything out. Here we go, inhale, gaze forward. Exhale, travel to the top of your mat. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, Parivrita, Uttita, Palangustasana. This time, left knee comes in line with your hips. Flex your toes towards your shin. Engage your core, squeeze your glutes, reach up through your fingertips, relax your shoulders away from your ears. One more breath, inhale. Exhale, sweep it back, right arm on your back thigh your back hamstrings rather, bicep femoris, reach up with your left hand, lunge into your right foot, viparita virabhadrasana. Stay for one more breath, inhale, exhale, left arm plants, right arm comes up for Ashvasanchalanasana. Two more breaths. Gaze up at your fingertips. And exhale, Anjaniyasana, Paribrita Anjaniyasana. Bring your hands to heart center, shift your weight forward, twist, placing your left elbow on the outside of your right leg. Again, the twist comes by lengthening your chest and turning your obliques in. Inhale. Exhale, big transition. 
front foot lengthens, back foot, 45 degrees, Trikonasana. One more breath, inhale. Exhale, big rotation with your left hand. Sweep it. As you do that, turn both toes, point forward. Right hand reaches towards your left foot. Open up, sending your left hand to the sky. Prasarita Padotanasana. One more breath, inhale. Exhale, big transition. Left toes point forward. Right foot, 45 degree angle. Tick tock your arms north and south to Trikonasana. Gaze up at your right hand. Find one more breath. Exhale. Parivrita Anjini Asana. Drop down to your right knee. Shift your weight forward and twist your prayer hands. Right hand outside of your left knee. Twist at your torso. Option to gaze up. Two more breaths. Inhale, plant your right palm to your mat. Open up, left hand to the sky. Paribita Ashpasan Chalanasana. One more breath, inhale. Exhale. To Paribita Virapadrasana. Right arm goes, left arm goes onto your right bicep femoris. Your hamstrings reach up through your fingertips, lunge into your front knee, flex your back knee, lengthen. Inhale. Exhale, shift forward. Parivrita Uttita Padagustasana. Right knee in line with your waist, toes flex towards your shin. Open up, left hand forward, right arm back, twist. See if you can look back and give yourself a thumbs up for showing up today. Inhale, exhale, plant your feet, forward fold, halfway lift, plant your palms flow through a vinyasa. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Nice. We're going to move that breath to movement going back and forth. <laughs> Let's see if we can keep up <laughs> or if I can get the Sanskrit names right. Like I said in my previous videos, I'm really trying to get them all down. That way I can teach across all platforms in all languages. Inhale, gaze forward. Exhale. Come to the top of your mat. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, Parivita Uttita Paragustasana. Open up. Exhale, Parivita Vira Padrasana. Left hand on your hamstrings, right hand to the sky. Inhale. Exhale, Parivrita Shvasanchalanasana, right palm to the ground, left palm to the sky. Inhale. Exhale, Parivrita Anjaneyasana, hands to heart center, shift forward, twist your prayer to the side. Inhale. Exhale, big transition, Trikonasana, Back foot 45 degrees, left leg straight, long, gaze up at the sky, inhale. Exhale, sweep your right arm, graze your mat, turn both feet forward, prasita padotanasana. Left hand reaches towards your right foot, right arm goes to the sky, inhale. Exhale, trikonasana, right foot straight, 
left foot 45 degree angle. Tick tock your arms north and south. Gaze up at the beautiful sky. Inhale. Exhale, Anjaniasana, Parivrita Anjaniasana. Drop down to your left knee, hands at heart center. Shift your weight forward, twist. Right elbow, left elbow on south, outside of your right knee. And twist, one breath, inhale. Exhale, drop your left palm, come up onto your left toes. Reach your right arm to the sky, inhale. Ashvasanchanasana. Exhale. Parivrita Virabhadasana. Right arm on your left bicep femoris. Reach up high with your left hand. Inhale. Exhale. Parivrita Uttita Padagustasana. Left arm back this time, right arm forward. Twist, gaze back, give yourself a thumbs up, inhale. Exhale, drop down. Halfway, rather forward fold. Halfway lift, plant your palms. Jump back, flow through a vinyasa. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Whew. Nice, we're gonna go back to the other side now. <laughs> Breath to movement. Inhale, gaze forward. Exhale, travel to the top of your mat. Inhale. Uddita hasta padangustasana. Twist, inhale. Exhale. Reverse twisted warrior. Inhale. Exhale. Ashvasan chavanasana. High lunge twist, gaze up. Exhale, Anjaniasana, hands to heart center, twist, body breathe, Anjaniasana. Inhale, exhale, Trikonasana. Inhale. <laughs> oh my god, <laughs> I fell out of that one. <laughs> that was too fast. Exhale, sweep your left hands to your mat. Prasarita Padottanasana. Right arm reaches towards your left. Twist. Gaze up. Inhale. Exhale, Trikonasana. To the front, left leg straight. Inhale. Exhale, right knee drops. Prayer, twist to your left. Inhale. Exhale. Body Brita Ashvasanchalanasana. Come up to your back toes. Your right toes, left hand reaches to the sky. Inhale. Exhale. Body Brita Viparadrasana. Virabhadrasana. They're all getting. <laughs> Twisted. <laughs> That's a good thing, right? We're working on twisting. I'll reach your right arm to the sky. Exhale. Parivrita Uttita Palagustasana. There it goes. Right arm reaches back. Gaze. Give yourself a thumbs up. Let's go. Exhale. Flow through a vinyasa. Halfway lift. Forward fold. Jump back. Upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Whew. Drop down to your knees. Get some water, towel off some sweat. We're gonna get into some core. Okay, whenever you're ready. Bring your feet in prayer, knees out wide. Slowly come down to your back. Interlace your hands behind your head. Inhale, pick up your chest and shoulders. Exhale, twist to the left. Inhale, drop down. Exhale, twist. 
Inhale, center, exhale, twist. Center, twist right. Center, twist left. Center and right. Four, eight, seven, six. Find a rhythm, five, four. Come back to your intention, three. Let's go for two. Last one. On one, hold and pulse, pulse, pulse. Four, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Hug your knees into your chest. Walk your legs up the wall. Steeple grip in your hands. We're gonna pulse to the left and right, doing twist across the body. Here we go for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Keep your legs up to the sky. Slowly start to lower them. Palms face down on your mat. We'll lift your legs up for eight, seven. Really engage your core. Six. Find your just do your focus. Five, four, three, just two. You got this. And last one. Beautiful. Hug your knees into your chest. Whew. Rock and roll the length of your mat. At the top, cross your feet. Jump back to downward facing dog. Take a breath here, inhale. Exhale, let's rock forward to high plank. Bend at your elbows, chaturanga. Inhale, upward facing dog. Take a moment here to lengthen out your abs. Let that feel good. One more breath. Maybe you want to dip to one side, to the other. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, gaze forward. Exhale, and travel to the top of your mat. Inhale, Utkatasana, chair pose. Sit low on your chair. This is our peak posture sequence. We're gonna go into Parshla Bakasana, twisted crow. Inhale, exhale, Uttanasana. Let's add a twist here. Inhale, bring your right arm to the sky. And exhale, release. Come up high on your toes. It's almost like a squat. Now here, toes continue to point forward. Both hands are gonna go to the side of your mat. About, about a, a foot distance between your palms. You'll bend both elbows, the front knees rest on your left elbow, and then your back hip onto your right for Twisted Crow. We'll have time to play around with this. Now start to bend into your crow. This works as great transitions. You can play around. Whenever you're ready, come back. Flow, do a vinyasa. We'll try it on the left side. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, gaze forward. Exhale, travel to the top of your mat. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, Utkatasana, chair pose. Sit lower into your heels. Squeeze your inner thighs. Arms to the sky, inhale. Exhale, hands to your heart center. Forward fold. This time plant your right palm in front. You can lightly place it and twist. Left arm to the sky. Exhale, place your palms. Come up high on your toes, squat and curl. Let's switch it out to the other side. Both palms facing 
the opposite direction or it's facing to the side your toes are still pointing forward the distance is about a foot between both palms and find a nice twist in your torso bend at your elbows and fly your crow option to use for beginner you can use both triceps to hold your weight but the goal is to only have your front tricep your front palm holding your whole body that way you can transition through really cool things as your practice continues to grow we'll try it again nice Whew. so we made it to free time y'all here play around with Parsva Bakasana we did a lot of twist so you can even try Kondanyasana um, just have some fun handstands against the wall headstands whatever you need just be careful pause the video have some play time and we'll be back for our surrender series How was it guys? I hope you had fun doing your Parshva Bakasana and you flew, twisted fly. Let me know how it went in the comments below. I would love to hear your progress. Let's begin to end our practice surrendering to this moment for our hard work. So come to seated, extend your arms out forward, slowly lower down to your mat. Walk your heels towards your fingertips and inhale, Setupanda Sarvangasana, bridge pose. Begin to shimmy your scapula so they're flushed on your mat. Interlace your hands and begin to slowly push your hips up to the sky. Option to gaze up at the sky. or close your eyes. We're here for one more breath, inhale. Exhale, slowly lower down. 
hug your knees into your chest. Squeeze them tight. Exhale, happy baby. Stamp your feet up to the sky. Begin to pull them closer towards your chest. Spine is nice and long on your mat. Good. Begin to slow it down. On your next inhale, hug your knees back into your chest. A cactus out your arms or let them fly long. And drop your knees to the right, gaze to the left. Last twist of class. Inhale, bring your knees back to center. And exhale, switch it out. Knees to the right, left, gaze to the right. Close your eyes. On your next inhale, collect your knees into your chest. Give your feet a kiss. <laughs> Squeeze them tight. One more breath. And exhale, Shavasana. Take up as much space as you need. Relax into this moment. Let go of all your expectations, all your judgments. Take this time to truly rest. Rest your mind, rest your body. I encourage you to stay here as long as you need. You worked hard for this rest. The video will end on its own. Thank you for flowing with me, B. Have a nice, flowy day. Namaste.